94.3 The Point. It's the Jersey Shores hit music channel. Hello there, 738. It's Lou and Liz. A mix of sun and clouds becoming windy with some scattered snow showers this afternoon or evening highs in the 30s. Uh, it's 16 this morning. Clear skies. Jersey Shores hit music channel. 94.3 The Point. We have Dana Connolly here from Squan Strong with such a fun event. Yay. You are inviting people to put on a kilt and help set a Guinness World Record That's for a great correct. cause by walking or running in Manasquan. So tell us what the event is called and what it's all about. It is the Jersey Shore record-breaking kilt run. Um, it's March 22nd. It's a two-mile fun run, walk. You have to have a plaid kilt, two buckles. You have to cross the start. And make it to the finish, and you're in. And uh, But as you said, exciting. you can walk, crawl, run, whatever you do. Just don't take the kilt off. <laughs> don't take the kilt off. Exactly. That's what the record's all about. Yeah. So what do, you, what, do you know what the, what the current record is? The current record is 1,700. Um, and right now, now and that's in Ireland, right? Uh, yeah, that yeah. is not even local. <laughs> um, and we were working with Geo from Dr. T-Shirt and John Sullivan of the Sullivan Group. They came up with this idea and approached Squan Strong with it. And of course, I'm all about it. It's fun. It's for a great event. There are, it should be them. warm by then. <laughs> we're hoping well, it'll yeah. be a little warmer by <laughs> then. Uh, you can wear pants under your kilt. I know it's not an option for a lot of people. Um, <laughs> but it should be a little bit warmer, and it'll be a great time. And it's all for a great cause, too. Tell us, for great people cause. that are not familiar, what Squan Strong is all about. Squan Strong is a total nonprofit grassroots organization that started after Superstorm Sandy. Um, we're still going forward. Believe it or not, there's still people not home. We just got an email for um, a bed for someone. Um, we have people moving and people still trying, struggling to pay rent. So going forward, we still want to get everybody home. And then, of course, if anybody needs help in other places, too, we're helping them. It's not only Madison. You've been in other places to, yeah, to help people Yeah, we've gone from there. Atlantic City to Asbury Park and then as far as Oklahoma. So it's it's exciting. It, it feels good, and, and there's no salaries involved. It's total nonprofit volunteers. We have the best volunteers yes, you ever. Yes, I can attest for that. Yeah, thank you. Now, really what, uh, there is a kilt pickup. If you, you can go online on our website, 943thepoint.com, or our Facebook page and get all the information. But you do have a pickup coming up this Saturday, right? This Saturday at Leggett Sandbar in Manasquan. Um, the pickup is from 11 to 3. If you haven't registered yet on jerseyrunner.com, you can register at Leggett. And Leggett's pick up your kilt there. If and you don't pick have your up own. our kilt. Um, you want to make sure, too, that we're going to cap it off at 2,500. So we have already have over 1,900 registered. So if everybody shows, we will break the record. That is awesome. Um, so there's going to be somebody there officially to count? Is that how that all works? We are going to use a timing company, and everyone will have a chip, and therefore uh -huh. it tracks them. It will know when they started, when they finished, when they crossed. So this way we have a whole running tally. Everybody will be listed. So it's going to be great. Awesome. How many opportunities do you have to be part of a World record. I mean, it's so cool. Me, one. And yeah. I plan on being in it. You know? <laughs> when we started, they were like, well, if we don't break it this year, you know, it'll get great momentum for next year. I was like, it's this year. And so far, it's, it's exciting. As we get closer, the momentum's building. So, like we said, we'll cap it off at 2,500. And what's really cool is if you are able to go get your kilt now, now you, know, you have time to do it. But if you get it now, this Saturday, then you can wear it for the Belmar St. Paddy's Day Parade Sunday. You can wear it for actual St. Paddy's Day. You'll get several uses out of your kilt. That's exactly right. Run. And Squan Strong is marching, too, in the Belmar Parade. We're partnering with our Manasquan Elks, um, whom we love. And they were there for us in the very beginning and still there for us. Uh, so we're going to march with them uh, in the Belmar Parade on Sunday. All right. Awesome, Dana. Thank you so much. That's and great. could you work on the weather for me on Sunday? <laughs> I can tell you this. The way our weather's been going, it's either going to be 40 or 95. That day. <laughs> it'll, come, it'll be one or the other. All right, well, good luck with that, and keep us updated. On and go the, to 94.3thepoint.com for all the details. Thank you. All right, thank you. Good luck. 742. Well, you put a kilt on? Um, I, I think it's at the dry cleaner now. <laughs> i got to track it down. All right, 742. Let's see what's going on on Monmouth and Ocean. Counties roads first. Nancy Remy's got it. What's up, Nancy? All right, well, certainly a lot of volume and some construction around.